This brief video is a two-dimensional animation of the Schaefer Rotary Vane Hydraulic Schematic. The process descriptions in the top left identify the component numbers that correspond to the schematic diagram. The Schaefer Rotary Vane Hydraulic Valve Operator is shown here in the neutralized open position. Power gas connected to the poppet block flows past the power storage tank check valve, through the power gas strainer, and fills the optional power storage tank. Power gas also flows into the backside of the poppet block, forcing the power poppets onto their seats. Simultaneously, the exhaust poppets are forced off of their seats. The cylinder ports are open to exhaust, venting any tank or operating pressure. This is the theory of operation for the closing stroke for the Schaefer rotary vane actuator. Closed signal pilot pressure enters the control block and forces the pilot piston against the exhaust poppet forcing it onto its seat. Power poppet is forced off of its seat, allowing power gas to pressurize the closing gas hydraulic tank, forcing the pressurized fluid into the actuator and causing the actuator to close. The fluid displaced from the actuator flows into the opening gas hydraulic tank, which is open to atmosphere through the exhaust check valve in the poppet block. The closed signal pilot pressure is removed, causing pilot pressure behind the pilot piston to bleed to exhaust through the orifice in the piston. Power pressure and spring tension reseat the power poppet and simultaneously unseats exhaust poppet, allowing the gas hydraulic tank and operator to neutralize. This is the theory of operation for the opening stroke for the Schaefer rotary vane actuator. Open signal pilot pressure enters the control block and forces the pilot piston against exhaust poppet, forcing it onto its seat. Power poppet is forced off of its seat, allowing power gas to pressurize the opening gas hydraulic tank forcing the pressurized fluid into the actuator and causing the actuator to open. The fluid displaced from the actuator flows into the closing gas hydraulic tank, which is open to atmosphere through the exhaust check valve in the poppet block. The open signal pilot pressure is removed, causing pilot pressure behind the pilot piston to bleed to exhaust through the orifice in the piston. Power pressure and spring tension reseat power poppet and simultaneously unseats exhaust poppet, allowing the gas hydraulic tank and operator to neutralize. 